what made you feel that the time was right to push forward 3D? Because really, you guys are the forefront of the 3D movement. I mean, you guys started it, really. Yeah. You got other directors like George Lucas is interested, yeah, Spielberg yeah. is interested, but it was really the, you guys forefronting the whole thing. Why now? Well, first go back to, Jim, when you were doing T2 3D. Yeah, I did T2 mm -hmm. 3D on film and 70 millimeter film with these big cameras that weighed 250 pounds back in 95 mm -hmm. before I shot Titanic. And at that point, there was no, no kind of 3D industry per se. There was a little bit for theme parks, <clears throat> but there was nothing for theatrical motion pictures. And in fact, after Titanic, I wasn't even thinking about doing a 3D movie. So in, in 2000, I started thinking about doing a 3D IMAX film. But those cameras were huge as well, mm -hmm. the film-based cameras. So I started exploring the idea of maybe an HD system that, would, that because of the combined resolution of the left eye and the right eye, sort of combining inside the brain, it might look good enough to, to actually stand up in IMAX 3D. So we did a test, and lo and behold, it looked pretty damn good. So we started down the path of developing a, a, a stereoscopic camera system using HD technology. Now, meanwhile, you've got digital cinema just starting up as an idea, and the whole industry is looking at it. And it turns out that the digital projectors would allow 3D in any movie theater anywhere, not just an mm -hmm. IMAX theater. So all of a sudden, it looked like there might be hundreds, if not thousands, of, of digital 3D uh, systems. <clears throat> so we did a number of documentaries in 3D just to kind of cut our teeth on, on how you make a film, how you get it to cut and all that sort of thing. And then uh, somewhere around 03, 04, so, somewhere in there, we started thinking pretty seriously about, about doing a 3D motion picture. And so here the landscape's starting to change very rapidly. So we were sort of at the beginning of it and then it was starting to sort of smoke past us. Mm -hmm. So we said, all right, fine, we're, we're going to make our 3D movie now and it'll take us a, a few years. It's a big project. But by the time we're done, there'll be plenty of screens. 